Tonight, family and friends gathering to remember a 23-year-old man who was shot to death last week. Police are still looking for his killer. Damian Chancellor was fatally shot Tuesday night during an altercation behind a Dayton furniture store. New at 10, 2 News reporter Kristen Escow live at the Dayton Police Department with more on today's vigil. Hey Adam, police say immediately after the shooting, a group of people ran off, leaving the victim behind. Today, family and friends gathered to remember the young man as his family remains without answers. He wanted to travel. He wanted to, you know, make his stamp in the world. Family and friends pray with balloons and candles in hand for a young man whose life was cut short. Officials say 23-year-old Damian Chancellor died at the hospital after being shot Tuesday night in an alley behind DJ's furniture on North Main Street. His sister describes him as a vibrant person with a great sense of humor. Making everybody laugh, even in my serious moments. He was just a very ambitious young gentleman. Police say they believe the shooting happened during an altercation. They say someone reported hearing a threatening statement, then a gunshot. Police say the group ran off, leaving Chancellor behind. Latasha Diaz says her family won't stop fighting for justice. We will continue until we have justice for Darian. I know that the law enforcement is working very diligently to find us answers that we don't have at the moment, but we do have faith in the justice system. And police are still investigating the shooting. Anyone with information is asked to call Crime Stoppers. We're live in Dayton. Kristen Escow, 2 News, working for you.